What is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel, we are back with Peter Quill, <laughs> aka Star-Lord and the rest of the Guardians of the Galaxy In the last part we just managed to escape the Grand Unifier, or whatever his name is And now we're back on the Milano, we need to try and call Cosmo because he's not been picking up If he's on your own here, hit that subscribe button And if you enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a wee like on it Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy, where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Peter Quill. Cosmo's ball has been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. What? Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. He's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet, this problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable to get through. Guardian of Galaxies must actually. So it looks like we're going to be going to Xandar then. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? <laughs> oh, what's going on? Who's this? So these are the cowards who the vile lady held Bender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flark are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Who the flark Therefore, are you, pal? Abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal Legion. A uh, lethal legion? Uh, more like loser <laughs> legion. <laughs> he surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. Lady Hellbender sends her regards, so called Guardians of the Galaxy. Prepare to be eliminated. No, you prepare uh, we'll to see be about eliminated. That. We'll get rid of you as an all. Smooth. Uh, we got this. Ah, uh, you're damn right we got this. <sighs> Defeat Captain Glory. And the Hit them hard and give no quarter. There's nothing on that garbage scout. Oh, one took down. We're taking fire. <laughs> Guys, I think we sent the non lethal legion. Feel free to show up. Oh, they'll just get too Be great out. My baby. Just keep watching. I need a mister. Bounty hunters after us. Means we're making a name for ourselves, right? Unlike you, it. I have done my research. Peter Kill. Oh my god, did we just blow up? Hit them hard and give no quarter. There's nothing on that garbage scour. Oh, so one. Brute, find us a channel to let the whole content. The blockers are forcing it open somehow. Your dying cries will be recorded as proof of your demise. How long go? Hide them behind the rocks. Got a piece of that guy. We're taking fire. Ah! Try not to get shot. There we go. Flying. Got four left. Ah. Pathetic. Guys, I think they sent the non-lethal legion. Must have been five. Ah. Still time to back off, Cap. Only one lethal lane. Don't forget you run away, Cap. Because you just get your asses handed to you. Who's the inferior life form now, huh? I still do. Peter, I'm picking up something. What? It appears I'll have to finish this myself. Okay, so he wasn't even an M So you defeated my fighters. But my cruiser will crush you. 
Hey. Come back, guardians. That's and it. Take That's out what the you one. About? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's. Oh. I'm sure it's very comfortable. I will not oh. be mocked. Then do something about it. Me no get need it. Come on, up. Lady skull suit us the worst block in timing. That did some real damage. Keep hitting his Whoa. exhaust ports. Your strength. Thanks. You just have to go. That it will. Oh, oh man. Starting to feel like you pissed off the whole galaxy. A good chunk of them anyway. Really need to work on our PR. Oh, 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 I don't know. I want to go. This guy's starting to sound like rocket. It's called language efficiency. What is it? Alright, go over here. Keep up the barrage. They will not survive it. Oh. <laughs> He's really pissing me off. Doesn't stand a chance. Does he go up too late? Where is he? Up there. Hiding behind a big rock. Oh, I am good. Yeah, I don't think these scrap sacks care if the galaxy's under sea. You know, contractors. We're contractors. Come on. He's doing us up, Quill. Here we go. Just kill them already. There's an I am trying, Gamora. Ha! Quill just tried the kill splane to the deadliest woman in the galaxy. There we go. That's good to have new. The hell? Why the fuck now? We really gotta take better care of the Milano. Yeah, we were a ship wash and a wax when this is all. My God. Right after you patch up all the holes. That was a bad hit. Right, hey, let me finish this guy, huh? I am Glory. Here we go. Warrior of. <laughs> See you later, Captain. Take that, Lady Skull Scut. I doubt we've seen the last of her. We'll worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. Punch it. Off to Xandar we go. Girl needs a tune up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my. Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open a channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. I am Groot. Had to leave. Power supplies are low. Need access to facilities. These ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. Oh, only ones want to go to Zanda. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous dome heads, but they're they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flark and deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. <sighs> I wonder if a grand unifier has got in. Welcome to Nova Corps headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. Standard. I know, bud, but now we can all follow along with Star Pants' mistakes. How, How may we assist you? Quill, pick something already. Officer Director. After scanning, scanning your ship, what our main near perfect algorithms pre selected several officer choices. The allocation, the allocation of resources for direct, direct communication, communication with us has been denied. We apologize for the inconvenience. Why is it well, being denied? Worth a shot. Let's try something else. Just pick something, Peter. 
Join the Corps. Congratulations on your decision to join the Corps. To begin, state your full name, designation, or serial number. Richard Ryder. Quo's mom. Quo's <laughs> mom. <laughs> this strategy is futile. Oh, come on, muscle brain. It might work. Oh, please you. Oh, uh, or artificial, artificial installation of origin. Someplace. Earth. Earth. I continue to doubt this strategy. Earth. Yeah, finally. finally. In a few words. Describe what made you want to join Nova Corps. Because I'm a sucker. Justice. Looks like the best AI in the world can parse that. Oh, first of all, man. Boys. All right, so that was fun, but a complete waste of time. Any other Thanks ideas? So, if it's no art, what is it? I know. Let's join the core and rob them. My good. We should tell them about the promise. Right. Perfine. Connecting, Connecting to banking services. I can't believe that worked. Guardians of the galaxy. Finally, we got any option. Hey, world mind, long time no see. It's me, Peter Quill, Star Lord, and uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No, no, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. galaxy. Cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the Promise is sweeping, sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts, worlds, and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda Galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They. Actually, the world mind is a collective consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of machine. Sure, and too. You better not call sure me. Sure, it can be stopped somehow. We just escaped the church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well, how to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know. How to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Novacore helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. The, the point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Zandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Zandarian culture is a lost cause. Culture is more than Tell location. them to guide you. You're Nova Corps leader. You have a They're duty to protect, protect this galaxy. That is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads. We do, we do not, not have a duty to protect this galaxy. We, we merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. You have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It, it would be, be a pointless, pointless sacrifice. For unknown reasons. The church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We can cannot adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? 
Faith as an energy source is illogical. illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it cannot be counted. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Ha! Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Corps? It... is not magical. But, but yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The, the living, living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. It exists because we exist, and we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Raker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the church does. Perhaps. You, you have given us new data to consider, Guardians of the Galaxy. We will. Later. Right now, we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did we not, not make this decision without considering all available options. Gotta play a complete with search of our just running away. only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Adam Warlock. Adam the Church's Warlock. original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great, so no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. <sighs> so they're going to pay a fine or what? Confirm payment. Cancel payment. Oh, if we pay a fine, will they maybe help us? But when we need their help again. And if we do ever need their help again, and we don't pay it, that could come back to haunt us. Let's go for confirm payment. All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on a Nova Corps fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. I'm Groot. They're taking off. The Nova Corps are running away. Did it then? You are accepting the promise. Oh, they're accepting we got it. We're going to. I know. Oh, ships are going to join them. Promises becoming real. Peter. Gotta get clear first. Come, Come on, on, get out of there. And go! Scott! Whoa! What the flark did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The loser legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Nice. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flocking water. And if they find us, we're screwed. Calm down, guys. Calm down. Oh, yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed. Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. 
How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diag- no, I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff? Then what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. What the hell? Are we going to do? Don't. I just... Can't do this right now. I need some rest. Screw Nova Corps. I shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. I'm just going to our quarters. Look, it's our great leader. If you're about to throw another tantrum, do it quietly this time. Let's see what she's got to say. Hey. Here to yell at me some more? What? No. I really don't feel like small talk. You. Fair enough. Got your toast. Right. Into my quarters. Really? How did you? What the hell is that doing on your bed? I'm gonna. Get... Come on, girl. Shoo, shoo. <laughs> what the? F it's true the whole in a war. Jesus Christ. And the bed smells. Great. The bed stinks of space llama. We're going to drift off and go into another flashback. What could the flashback be, but. Already seen his mom dying. Raccoon's waiting for you. Everybody is. Uh, Rocket, yeah, he was fixing that thing that broke. Hey, if we're some kind of big space hero now, why are we running from the bad guys? <sighs> it's complicated. No, it's not. Stop running. And we've landed. Uh... <sighs> Looking pretty cool, Peter. Rock and roll. Right. Root wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? Oh, how long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. Wait, how do we fly out here? Quill, do you want to fix your ship or not? My ship. Yes, your ship. Come on, the others are outside. So we're back at a quarantine zone. Why are you at a quarantine zone? Once we're outside, should I be looking around, lifting stuff? Only if you want to get your hands all sticky. So you flew us all the way here? Yep. Without asking? Hey, I asked. You said, and I quote, I'll take you to the stars. I'll show you who we are. We're space riders with no name. Uh, and then you went back to sleep. We've got to be still yes. dreaming, aren't we? Good enough for me. Whenever you're ready, Quill. There, let's go. Oh, 
Arba stout riemen. Look who stumbled out of bed. The rodent made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough? What? Nikki? You're not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... Oh, we're definitely dreaming it. <laughs> Nikki! Guys, don't let it get to you! Won't have to tell me twice! Come on, run! How are we supposed to see where we're going? Oh, get it! Rocket! Oh my god, they're all going to get sucked up, aren't they? Quick, run, Drax! Come on! Stop. We can't keep running away from our problems. Well, take that, you ugly monster thing! Ah. Stand up here. Peter Quill. Peter Quill, wake up. Ah. <sighs> Drax. We talked about this, man. You gotta stop. Your illegitimate child was correct, Peter Quill. Hovat and Camaria will be restored. Are you just going to start believing at that? Yeah. Okay. Um, we just need to have faith. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> uh, Drax, you're kind of freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family. Get him locked mother, up. The Cree woman. You understand the pain that comes from loss. Drax. But with faith, with the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I, I, Drax, I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? Why? I... Totally accepted it. I am super stoked to see my mom again. And we want to fight in drugs. Yes, right, right, my, my daughter. I knew you would see the truth of her light, Peter Quill. Yep, uh, the truth and light, dead. Not dead, uh, my daughter, it's all super great. This pleases me. I am less certain of the others. The wooden one may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Appeal to Drax. Because that's murder, man. See if we can get them to come run. If you kill them, then they can't accept the promise. The matriarch will bring them back, along with everyone else. That is her promise. Right, right. She'll she'll bring them back. I just thought you were trying to turn a new leaf. I do not have foliage. I'm just saying. Think of the example you're setting for Camaria. The matriarch's promise requires uncompromising faith. Something you would understand if you had truly accepted it. Dra Dra Drax, I swear. Choose well, Peter Quill. We've landed on the Matriarch's planet. When I return, she will demand your answer. 
Wait! Drax! Now he's locked us in. We can talk about this! Crap, 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 crap. Please let there be calms, please let there be calms. Also, please be okay. Right, we're obviously going to go to this hole, aren't we? No? Oh god, what if Drax... No! Stop, you can't think like that. Right, how the hell are we going to get out? They're probably fine. I just need to make sure. Somehow. Oh, I've had to pick your comms up. <laughs> Hello? Anyone? Peter? Is there a reason why Muscles locked me in my room? Yeah. Drax may have kind of joined the church. What? Seriously? I know, it's, it, it's super messed up, Drax. Drax is kind of messed up. He also may have landed us on Sacrosag to find the matriarch. But don't worry. I may have an idea. Yeah, we're going to go with Arby. The llama thing's been chewing through my wall. Cammy did? It has a name? Point is, maybe it's a way to get out. Right. So it looks like we're going to be escaping out of our quarters. God knows how we're going to we take Drax down. We named her after Drax's daughter. Before he betrayed us. Right, well... Before we go any further, we'll end that part here, and we'll be escaping out of our quarters in the next part. God knows how we're going to take Drax down, but we'll be finding it. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.